Hi folks, my name is Vladimir Palfi and in today's video tutorial I'd like to show you how you can use the join feature with Creo Parametr 3.0. I'd like to start with 3D modeling and if you need to go you can directly jump to convert to sheet metal system automatically change the solid model to sheet metal you can see different icons here if you would like to use the join feature is right now it's not available because you need to create two intersecting walls so for example i like to create the first extrude feature and it will be only straight line and i will specify uh, the symmetric shape and any dimensions yeah okay and again i will create the under the extra feature i would like to use the same sketch plane so sorry one more time i was so quick you can use the placement define and the select use preview sketch plane the system automatically jump to preview sketch plane you can use it in any feature where the creo needs the sketch the system remember the last select text orientation over here i will create new extended line and have a look here the system would like to create and remove the material but i don't want to remove material i'd like to use the function add material asymmetric you can use the right mouse button here or select the drop down menu from the ribbon so for now i have created two separate flat feature and you can see here that system automatically detect two pieces the one piece and second piece if you have a two pieces in the editing tab you have a function join and what does it mean you can select the first one and control the second one and the system auto automatically with the previous window or 3d preview you can see how it will be looks the final result right now you can work with the arrows directly in 3d and the combine the selected surfaces or objects or you can use the ribbon again and use the flip arrow here you can see that is the possible to define relief if it is necessary so you can change it or in the option tab you have the another options that you would like to trim the the geometry yeah or you don't want to see the preview selected geometry so it depends what you need to do and how you would like to reuse this feature yeah so right now the rip feature or relief will be visible and you can work with it so i hope so that you like this quick video tutorial about how to use the join feature with creo parametric 3.0 have a nice day bye bye